Hello, I'm Mike Russell from MusicRadioCreative.com. Today I'd like to show you an effect that I feel is highly underused, particularly on voiceovers in Adobe Audition. Let's head over and start recording right now. Control, Shift, N. Go incognito. Now that's going to be a jingle for Reddit user Papasse, who has a locally gigging band who's, well, growing in popularity right now. So I thought the Guitar Suite would be nice for you. Now usually, if we go into Special here and Guitar Suite, you'd expect to use this, of course, on a guitar, but it works well on vocals as well. Some of them are quite large and bombastic, like Control that. Uh, some of them are not so bad, like, for instance, the Drum Suite. Control. control. That sounds a bit chorusy. So let's apply that to Control. Control. There you go, you can see it's fattened it up a bit as well. Uh, again, we'll go back into Special, Guitar Suite, Shift, and we'll add something else to this, Slightly Burned, Shift. So you can hear a little bit of distortion there, and boom, look at that, wow! That is one heck of a waveform, isn't it? Totally different to this waveform. So let's try and get them around about the same volume, so we're working with something at a similar level. And then again, back into the Guitar Suite which I feel is highly underused as an effect, particularly on vocals. And let's look for something else like Tin Can Telephony. N, N, N. It's interesting, isn't it? Okay, let's apply that. N. And then finally on this, Go incognito. we're going to use the Guitar Suite one more time by going to Special Guitar Suite, searching for something else we like. Go incognito. That's a bit um, painful on the ears. Go incognito. Not too sure about that. Go incognito. That's too low. What about lowest fidelity? Go incognito. That's cool, that's something different, isn't it? Sounds a bit like AM radio. Let's bring that up now to the right level, and uh, actually we can normalize the whole thing. Drop it into the multi-track for you now, and just mix it into a jingle. So here it is. Let's add, first of all, my processing preset, which is here. Control, Shift, N. Go incognito. Now I need to do a little bit of doctoring to the volumes there as I bring in some sound effects, because obviously it's quite jumpy at the moment. Let's bring this in. That could be interesting. This could be interesting. That's the kind of effect I'm looking for. Here we go, this could work. So. Control. 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 Shift. Let's pull that down in volume. Shift. And then move this along a little bit. Might not need that third effect. Okay, now we've got too much of a gap between Control Shift and N, so I'm going to need to tailor these effects. Let's have a listen. Control Shift. Okay, nearly there, and then need to move the N in a bit. Okay, that could actually go in like that. Let's try that. Control Shift. Okay, we're nearly there. Just need to move that in a little bit more. Control, shift, and. Control, shift, and. Control, shift, and. There you go, that sounds about right to me. Sometimes, as a producer, you can sit there for ages, just trying to get it a millisecond in the correct direction. It's very annoying sometimes, especially when you haven't got a second set of ears to tell you if it sounds good or not. Uh, now we just need the Go Incognito tagline on the end. So let's see how we can make this work and sound really good. Let's try and drag that in. Go Incognito! Okay, that's going to work. And here we go, especially for you Reddit user Papasse and anyone else who likes using the Guitar Suite in Adobe Audition, here's a jingle for your band. Control, Shift, and Go Incognito.